Montrose Access was established in 1933 and provides therapy, respite and recreation services to Queensland children and young adults with physical disabilities. Over 75 years, Montrose Access has assisted thousands of Queensland families in need. We are currently providing service and support for approximately 600 families across Queensland. Our services include community-based therapy services, such as occupational therapy, physiotherapy, speech pathology and social work, recreation programs, custom orthotics, in-home respite and out-of-home respite. Well, I'm Louise Stewart and this is Darcy Stewart. This is my daughter, Georgie Bishop Cash. And Georgie's seven. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> and Potts, we've been coming to Montrose for around 10 years. My name is Jodie. Um, Montrose is a good place. I like coming here to socialise with friends. Um, Felicity Cooper. We've been coming to Montrose now for a little over 10 years. Montrose Access is quite unique as we currently treat children and young adults with numerous physical disabilities of varying severity. We also work with a number of children with rare or undiagnosed conditions where the availability of assistance would otherwise be very limited. We do not duplicate services provided by condition-specific organisations. We provide services to those children who would not otherwise be able to obtain them. Montrose Access provides a holistic team approach to best suit the individual needs of each child. Darcy's been a client at Montrose for about two and a half years. Over the last uh, year or so we've been doing hydrotherapy and in that's coordinated here at Montrose. Over the last six months we've seen an astounding improvement in Darcy's capabilities and she is now swimming um, confidently as a four-year-old in the pool. She is um, able to um, exercise more while she's in the pool and her confidence is, is, um, is quite markedly improved. So um, we're able to see a little girl who's building muscle and growing and developing and getting ready for school, which is our big priority with, with Darcy's development at the moment. We've been coming to Montrose Access for five years since Georgie was two years old. Yep. She's had the orthotics all of her life um, and probably till she's 18 years old and I'm hoping that she'll be in normal shoes then. Darren with them um, who makes the orthotics is just lovely and he always does new things with her shoes to help her feet. Darren is really funny in the orthotics room, isn't he? Mm. He does something, he blows his gloves up, doesn't he? Yeah, he blows his gloves up. <laughs> Makes he, them into balloons. Yes. And he's very gentle, isn't he? Yep. And caring. I'm Darcy's mum first, but I'm also Darcy's coach. Darcy's advocate and I'm the person who has to make everything happen for Darcy so and that's a big and challenging role for me and I find the social work service that Montrose provides it, it's fantastic and um, you know it, it's just another resource that helps us do the job as a family that we've got to do and next year we'll be accessing that to help us with the challenges that going to school will, will bring for Darcy. And they go to your school as well, don't yeah. they? Yeah, it's pretty cool when they come to school. I get all excited. <laughs> you do. Because I know their faces and I just really like the people they are. They're nice and gentle and nice and I just really like them. The social worker will help the children prepare as well as us as a family and the school prepare for Darcy. Yeah, Matthew comes to social group once a month uh, for the over 15s and they do lots of exciting things. Christopher has started to come. Um, he has joined the social club, which he loves. When they go to the football I like that and the movies and it's really good. It's a good out for the children because it, it gets them out with other children, socialising, they don't feel different. <laughs> well, it gives Matt a break from home. Um, I do have another son at home with Duchenne, um, 
So instead of having two, I usually just have one at home for a weekend. They have a really good time. He really loves it and would come more, um, except we like to have him at home as well. He doesn't ever want to come home. <laughs> they sometimes have a mother's pamper morning where the mums come along and we get pampered for the whole morning and get a lovely morning tea and we get a chance to chat and catch up, which is really good. Talking to another mum who's going through what you're going through is probably the best thing you can do. I think having all the services from one organisation is beneficial because everybody is a team, they all work together. It's fabulous for us to be able to access all the services, all the people we need to talk to, all in one location. You know, whether it be an occupational therapist, a speech therapist or physio, they're all here. They do work together really well. Um, and we just find they're a very dedicated team. The speech therapy we've accessed with Matthew more so than Christopher. They have come into the home, showed us different techniques to help him with his speaking. In my skills I've learned how to make phone calls and how to work out money where to go shopping and cooking. Um, so we've been learning how to ask people questions and stuff. So, yeah. Just interacting with everyone, like meeting new people and um, doing activities that we come to do here. Yeah. Occupational therapies help the boys with their fine motor skills. They also come out to the school and help us with different programs for the children to, to work at school more efficiently. And they've also come to the home and help with, with different things, even little living skill things at home as well. With those skills, the therapies helped because the boys have problems with, with writing for extended period of times. So they do keyboard work and even as far as at home with, with living skills, with dressing skills, being able to tie shoelaces, just a, a lot of different areas that they can help us with. While Montrose Access has offices in Brisbane, Pine Rivers and at the Gold and Sunshine Coasts, the services we provide for our clients and their families also include outreach visits to families throughout Queensland. We also provide a resource centre for equipment loan and short-term accommodation for families in on-site flats while in Brisbane. Montrose Access has a staff of over 100 and we are supported out in the community by scores of volunteers, supporters and corporate partners. We love Montrose and we're so glad to be in with Montrose, they're so supportive. And they not only support uh, Christopher and Matthew but they support their sibling, uh, they support the parents. The staff are helpful and yeah, very nice. Yeah. I like coming to, to Montrose, see my friends and just hang out with them for a while. I couldn't survive without Montrose, we couldn't been a great benefit to us uh, and I know to a lot of other families. I don't know where we'd be if we hadn't seen them. I'm glad Montrose is here. Montrose Access. With your help, we will continue helping kids to reach their maximum potential.